Sometimes I feel like I'm lost in space, and I'll never come down to Earth. But who knows if I've ever even truly been here. Maybe I've always been lost and just too corrupted to realize it. And corruption plus not wanting to go outside is not a good combination. People think it's just something that's happening to me, but it's something I have to deal with every single day. Maybe others have noticed and I'm just too oblivious. I... I can't imagine what it would be like to be out of my bubble. It's a place I feel most at home. The only place, even if my parents think I'm trapped in it. They always say I need to come out of my shell, but I... I can't. And people always say I'm stuck in my head, but my head is stuck in me, so where else am I supposed to be? I don't understand the world around me more than I understand the one inside, even though I barely understand that one either. I'm not sure how my brain works this way, but maybe that's something I'll have to find out. Maybe I'm chemically imbalanced. <laughs> Uh, I feel like the opposite of what I'm supposed to. So much goes on inside my mind, but I'm fine, really. I don't get it, but I feel like two people occupy my head. Or at least that's the most logical thing I could come with. Two sides of the same coin, I guess. I'm so different, inside and out. People always say, oh, you're such a selfless person. But in reality, I think that should be the opposite. Selfishness isn't a good thing, but loving yourself is different. Selflessness isn't always a good thing either. It can lead you away from self-love. Some things just don't add up, and I've learned there's not much I can do when it comes to the imbalance inside and out. I don't know how my mind works like this, but I guess that's something I'll have to figure out. I met Charlie several years ago at this party my mom made me go to. We were the only people there who didn't have fake smiles plastered onto their faces, so we hit it off pretty quickly. We talked online for a while after that and even met up in person several times to see each other. Then we both got pretty busy with family and school and we haven't talked in a few years. Charlie? Ren? It's been so long. Too long. Yeah, it, it has. How, how are things? Uh, things, uh, things are okay. What about you? Oh, uh, good. Applied to a lot of colleges, uh, gotten to SCAD like we always said we would do together. Listen, it's, it's, it's a nice day, you know? We haven't seen each other in a long time. You want to go sit and sure. talk? 